Thanksgiving. Why should we give thanks for everything? Because everything that we have received, except our sins, are pure gifts from God. But especially we should give thanksgiving for all that refers to the <clears throat> Most Holy Eucharist. Let's give thanks for Holy Thursday in which our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, the High Priest, took bread, took wine, and said, Take and eat, this is my body. Take and drink, this is my blood. By doing this, our Lord gave us this great gift, the gift of the Most Holy Eucharist. And Eucharist means thanksgiving. Give thanks to the Lord for His good, for His love endures forever. Let's continue our thanks. Let's give thanks to God for the gift of the priesthood. Because there at the Last Supper our Lord, in the context of the Last Supper our Lord, gave us also the priesthood. When He said to the apostles, who would become the first priests and the bishops, <coughs> Do this in memory of me. Let's continue our thanks. Let's thank God every time we go to Mass and the priest lifts up the host and he lifts up the wine. In that moment, Christ is looking at us with great love. In that moment, Christ truly becomes present in his body, blood, soul, and divinity. How much thanks, how much gratitude we should have for that great gift every time that we assist at the holy sacrifice of the Mass. Let us give thanks to the Lord, especially for the moment of Holy Communion. The most intimate union between God and man is when we receive the sacred host into the depths of our very being, into our hearts, into our souls. How grateful we should be for this. Finally, we should give thanks to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ for this. He said, I will be with you always until the end of the world. If indeed our Lord has ascended on high, or is seated at the right hand of God the Father, then where is He? He is truly present in His mystical body, which is the Church. But especially He is present in the consecrated host in the ciborium, in a special way he's present in the tabernacle, which we're invited to come to visit him, to talk to him, to worship him, to praise him, and especially to thank him. So let's live out Thanksgiving. Let's live out Thanksgiving, thanking God for the material gifts that he's given to us, but especially let's give thanks to God for the great gift of the Most Holy Eucharist, and Eucharist actually means Thanksgiving.